Hey guys, this is Onelfri from Onelfri.com and I want to welcome you to the second training video in the Advanced Traffic Series. Um, if you purchase my book, Secrets to Blogging Success, I want to congratulate you on taking that first step uh, towards your success online. And also I really want to take this chance to, um, to give my thanks to you, um, to my readers and um, the way I show my thanks, which I always have, is by providing the best, most valuable content that I can at no additional cost to you. So this is why I'm doing these additional training videos and I'm going to do one more as a series of three. So I hope you enjoy them. In this one, we're going to talk about three free web-based marketing tools that you probably are not aware of. Um, so if you have your own online business or you want to promote your website and you don't have much money or any money at all for that matter, um, you can either hope for the best and wait for web users to discover you like a lot of people do when they set up their blog and you know they got the domain and everything set up and they're like, okay, I'm just going to sit back and wait for everybody to visit. Or you can use one of these free marketing techniques. Uh, to drive free traffic to your pages for no money at all. The beauty of these tools, um, other than the fact that they're free, is that they can provide you with great results. And all you have to invest is your own time and effort. Uh, they don't require any financial investment at all. So if you've got some time and effort but not that much cash to spend, um, these methods are for you. Uh, so the first one is use Craigslist. Um, as you can see, this is an example ad over here that I actually did on Craigslist, but this is a paid ad to to a free event. It's funny on Craigslist, if you promote a free event, you have to pay, but if you promote a paid event, you can do it for free. Uh, so that's one technique that you can use um, if you have a paid product or if you have a paid service or an event that you're doing. Um, you can put a small price on it and you can get free promotion for that. Another way to use Craigslist is, um, of course, if you ever wanted to buy used furniture, look for a job, or even find romance, you're probably already familiar with Craigslist anyways. Um, so it's the biggest and most popular free uh, classified listing on the internet in the US and elsewhere. So classifieds are very good. Um, uh, I believe there are some other ones that are very popular in other countries. Um, so just look for classified um, and then put in your country into the search engines and see what comes up to find other classified websites um, but uh, you have to know a few tricks um, when you use Craigslist like the ones I already mentioned to you um, or depending on your website's niche there's a Craigslist category you can use to promote it uh, Craigslist actually has discussion forums that are very old actually um, and not too many people know about them. You know, forum marketing is really popular online. A lot of people do it and because it's, ex because it's effective. But did you know that Craigslist also had their own discussion forum? And they have topics on everything from health and, and beauty products to sports teams to celebrities and dog owners. Um, and you don't have to pay to post on these forums. So the only Craigslist posting that, that costs anything is our help wanted ads and the ones I told you if you want to promote like a free event in your area. <clears throat> so participating in forums related to your niche is a free and easy way to get exposure for your website where people who already are interested in your niche are gathered. So this is where your target market is and there's probably not too many people on here. So you will have a good chance of uh, driving some good traffic to your site if you use it effectively. Engage in conversations with other Craigslist users on the common threads so you can promote your products and services. Not straight off the bat, but you know, providing value and providing um, the fact that, that what you offer actually answers their question. You want to build your professional reputation and identify prospective customers that you can convert into loyal fans. Another way of doing this to engage in the conversation, see what the questions are that are being asked that are related to your product or service. You know, see how you can uh, 
contribute to that conversation overall. You know, um, internet marketers don't compete with each other. That's a lot of mistake that people make. They uh, they partner with each other, so it's totally different. Okay, guys, so don't jump on um, tr on the train and try to promote your product straight off the back. See what it is that's, that's being asked most commonly in your niche and see how you can provide value for that. Okay, RSS feeds are another highly effective free tool for promoting your website or online business. Um, um, I use FeedBurner. You can just uh, do a Google search, FeedBurner.com. And you can make a custom RSS feed here. RSS um, is basically uh, a family of web web feed web web feed formats used to publish frequently updated works like your blog. They are they are sort of like a web version of a newswire service. So the biggest difference is that the content can be about anything. You can even include video, audio recording, slideshows, infographics, and other types of content. So users who subscribe to free RSS feeds receive content delivered to their RSS reader. For example, if you've heard of Google Reader, um, that's a really famous one. And I believe um, there's one that's called Feedly as well. And I think they also integrated Google Reader with Feedly. Uh, so you can check that out. Um, so the advantage that you have by doing this is that... Um, you know, instead of notifying your readers when you have new content, you know, they automatically get an update um, to um, to their email um, to notify them, hey, there's a new post on this RSS feed. Uh, so you can promote your website using RSS feed by offering your own RSS feed to subscribers. That way you can provide a constant stream of information about new products, price changes, availability, promotions, and other things related to your business. Choose from a variety of RSS aggregators to build your feed and offer it to your customers. They are, one of them I use is called FeedBurner, like I already mentioned. Uh, so you guys can definitely check that out. And it's also too, the, the great thing about RSS feed is that it doesn't require too much resources um, from a computer or from your internet provider. It's, it's very much like a simplified version of your website. So it loads a lot faster. For those who really have to pay for every last bit of data that gets transferred to this phone. So this can be useful for you. And a second way is to provide your content via someone else's RSS feed. Such as an existing local business uh, groups feed, um, an industry feed, a news feed, or any other feed that would accept your content. They usually, um, a lot of big sites have their own feed. So if, if you can um, see if... If you can promote your stuff on their feed, that would be awesome. Whichever method you use, uh, make sure the content that you provide is valuable and accurate, and that you will always include a link to your website when permitted. <clears throat> Lastly, I want to share with you um, this website that's actually sent a lot of traffic to my website because um, it's directly related to what I'm doing. Um, you know, I'm providing marketing value, um, uh, showing my experience, not just ideas, but the ideas in action and what I have gained from it, the experience I've gained from it, and my results, which I also share in my book, Secrets to Blogging Success. So this website is called Growth Hackers. You can just go to growthhackers.com. Um, and, and it's basically like, uh, it's a community. It's, a, it's basically a social community. That's all about growth hacking, you know, hacking your way to grow your business. Um, they use uh, tags and uh, from your site or from your posts, you know, to identify the content. So you can submit a page. Every time you post an update to your blog, you can submit your page to Growth Hackers. And you'll get traffic from there as long as you have a great headline and great content that, that you're sharing. <clears throat> Remember, everyone on Growth Hackers is there because they already have an interest and they're most likely, they're most likely part of your target market. So you want to take advantage of this. You know, it's extremely targeted traffic and that's the kind of traffic that we want. Laser targeted, okay? Um, if you have your own blog, uh, these kinds of websites are really good. You know, they're a really excellent way to help 
help people find your content. Um, it also serves as, as a centralized site for everything having to do uh, with marketing and growth hacking, for example. And they offer other articles and other links involving uh, um, other bloggers' news and statistics. And um, I believe they have uh, a forum as well, too, so you can definitely check that out. Another one that you can use is called AFF Post, uh, short for affiliatepost.com. Um, this is another great way of doing it. They have a sponsored post option, which can get your posts um, straight, um, you know, on the front page, but you have to pay uh, 250000 a month so they can advertise your post for you, basically. But you can also just submit your site for free. Um, it kind of works like a, like an article directory or like a blog directory. But it takes a little longer for them to accept it. Um, but, you know, it's free of charge, so why not give it a try? So you see, you don't really have to have a lot of money to drive traffic to your web pages. At least, if, if not if you use these three free web-based marketing tools. Now you know. Um, I hope you enjoy what you learned today. Check back weekly for updated videos and lessons. Or better yet... Um, you can subscribe to my RSS feed by going to feedburner.com slash Um So this is part two of the free uh, training advanced traffic videos in the series. And I hope that you enjoy it and have been gaining value until this point. There's more to come, so please stay tuned. Once again, this is Onelfree from onelfree.com. Thank you.